Congressman Dan Beneshek began his second term in office last week. This week, he's been in the Upper Peninsula to host a pair of community forums to listen to residents' concerns. He visited Escanaba Tuesday for one of those sessions. Beneshek was one of the House Republicans who voted for the fiscal cliff compromise deal. Now that the deal has avoided tax increases for 99% of Americans, he says it's time to address spending. The president doesn't want to cut anything. I don't want to see our children uh, be suffering under a, a pile of debt. And there's going to be hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat, trench warfare uh, with the president to get some spending cuts. Those clashes will have to do with the debt ceiling and a wide range of automatic spending cuts that are currently scheduled to take place in March. The fiscal cliff deal ended the two-year-long reduction of Social Security taxes that gave many low-income Americans a break. To fund Social Security. I mean, that was a tax holiday that, frankly, I was opposed to from the beginning because we need to continue to be sure that Social Security uh, is there for the long term. Congressman Beneshek held a similar event in Iron River Monday night to listen to Iron County residents.